There are many types of Z-frames to choose from. For this drywall window, we will install the Beller Z-frame using a nail gun. Once you have your 2 inch Beller Z laid out on the floor, assemble the top frame to the left frame using a Hoffman key. A hard flat surface like this plywood here is ideal to accomplish this. The flat end will be placed on the hard surface while the round end will be inserted into the frame. Simply place one end of the frame onto the Hoffman key and press down. Take your other frame, place it on top of the Hoffman key and press down until both frames are flush. Repeat these steps until the frame is together. Now that the frame is completely assembled, take it to the window to center the opening. Now that we've placed the frame in the window, we'll continue to center it. Using your shims, simply place one below and one on top until the frame is centered. Once the frame is centered, top to bottom, we can now center it left to right. Now that we've centered the frame into the window, we can start by fastening the frame to the window using our nail gun. We'll nail into the upper left hand corner first. We'll level the frame next. And now we'll nail the upper right hand corner. Now that that's complete, we'll take our panels, put them in the frame, and install the hinge pins. We'll take the right panel, install it into the frames, with our hinge pin. Now we can rack the panels back and forth to line them up. Once the panels are lined up, we can nail them into the wall. Check and make sure that they're even across the top Open the other side and nail it. Once the panels are even across the top, place a shim behind the frame and nail it to the wall. Check and make sure your reveal stays the same. Do the same below. Simply place the shim underneath the frame. Check and make sure the reveal is the same. And nail the bottom frame to the wall. Now that the panels are installed, and the panels are even across the top and across the bottom, and all of our reveals are the same, we can finish by securing it to the wall. Simply place a nail above the hinge and below the hinge on both top and bottom on both sides of the opening. Also, if need be, you can place one in the middle.